Hey guys, it's Aaron Farmer with My Sugar Free Journey, and it is another Weight Loss Wednesday. Um, so it's it's been uh, it's been a bit of an up and down. Uh, I ended up one pound down from last week, so I'm 27 pounds down, um, sitting at 293. Um, the we moved. And you might notice that uh, we've got a new background behind me. We moved uh, for the last week, and that really derailed me. There were there were several days when uh, we didn't have you know, I didn't have my stove. We were, you know, in and out. I couldn't really cook for myself. We had to get fast food, and it was shocking. Uh, it was really, really amazing how fast I put weight back on once I started eating, you know, just just two or three meals of greasy fast food because uh, because I, you know, I couldn't control the, I couldn't control cooking my own food. Uh, how fast I packed the? I mean, I was I was up to almost 300 pounds, like nothing I like it was nothing uh how fast that the uh the weight came back on so after we finished moving i had to get things back under control and now we're we're kind of starting over and starting the process of of pulling the weight off a pound or two you know a day just just uh just controlling what i'm eating so now down 27 pounds from where i started down 293 i should have been farther but whatever um but a couple other things that have happened uh, because of where we moved uh, didn't have a pool that where we were staying before had a pool so I went and had to join a gym just so I'd have a place to swim um, and I've really been amazed at how um, as I've cut out the sugars as I've cut out the grains as I've been eating more fat more real food um, I've been amazed at the my endurance uh, you know and you know I'm a three I've been a 300 plus pound, I've been almost 400 pounds at one point in my life, you know, endurance has never, you know, I've never really been able to do anything for a long period of time, but, um, you know, I can ride a bike for about five miles, and I don't feel overly stressed when I get off, uh, I can swim for uh, over about a half a mile a day, every day, and it, it doesn't really, like, it doesn't, uh, I feel it a little bit in my shoulders, but it doesn't just wear me down, you know, before, if I'd have tried to do that, I'd have had to come home and take a nap, you know, but uh, I, I don't feel, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't really drain me like it used to, uh, so that's been a really big, uh, a really big point in the plus column as, a, as I've changed my diet, as I've changed what I've eaten, uh, just to see that weight come off, it's been, it's been absolutely amazing, so I've got a new goal, my goal, I've never in my life done a pull-up. Never, not even when I was a kid. I was, you know, I just, you know, I was too big, uh, and uh, was never able to do a pull up. I think I want to do a pull up, so, so that's what I'm working towards. Um, right now, I have to take uh, like 180 pounds off. You know, if you, you've seen machines at the gym, you can set the weight, and uh, you stand on these levers, and it takes. So if you set it at 200 pounds, it it, you're, when you do a pull-up, you're lifting your body weight minus 200 pounds. So I'm about 180 right now. I'm going to get that down as I lose weight and as I, as I get stronger. Uh, I'm going to eventually I'm going to get a, get to do a pull-up um, uh, under under my own strength. So that's that's my goal right now. That's where I'm headed, and uh, that's what I'm that's what I'm after. Um, I posted an article the other day about the importance of having having the right attitude. Uh, as you cut the sugar out of out of your life, it's so crucial. Um, and uh, you know, if you if you're always thinking about all the things you can't have, um, can't have desserts, can't have you know sandwiches or whatever, it's you're gonna have a miserable time. But once you educate yourself on what sugar is, what it does to your body, how it's a, a long term, uh, how it's a long long term chronic toxin for your body, it breaks down your your body, it makes you more susceptible to all kinds of diseases, not just diet. I mean, the, the obvious ones are like diabetes and high blood pressure. We've talked about that a lot. But, uh, you know, every study that comes out, there's something new that that, uh, that sugar does that's bad for you. The last one I was reading it says that sugar, it doesn't cause cancer, but when you get cancer, Cancer cells love high blood sugar. They love to. They love all that sugar. They 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 uh, metabolize that sugar. It's what causes them to to spread and to grow quickly. Um, so if you reduce the amount of sugar you eat, you become less less susceptible to a fast growing cancer. 
the links between sugar and uh, prostate cancer especially are, are just overwhelming. So that stuff is bad for you. Now, just uh, you know, as my, my personal struggle, the one thing that I have not been able to cut out of my diet, I know it needs to come out. I don't want it there, but goodness, uh, I was not prepared for how addicted I was to, uh, to Coke Zero. Um, I don't. I don't really want to drink it anymore because uh, because it's sweet and I, I I feel like it's it doesn't have sugar in it, but it's sweet. I feel like it could be kind of a gateway to get back into things. But man, when I leave the house, I want a Coke Zero, uh, and it's it's uh, it's incredible. When I stop and get gas at a gas station, I want to go in and get a Coke Zero. Um, and so that's the one thing that I'm working on. I thought I had it. I went two or three days without a Coke Zero, and then yesterday I went and got gas, and oh, look, I've got a Coke Zero in my hand when I walked out. I didn't didn't even think about it. Um, so that's the one thing I'm working on. That's 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 what more of my challenges right now. But overall, things are going great. As I've cut more sugar out of my diet, as I've cut more empty carbs and grains out of my diet, uh, the weight is coming off. I have more energy. I feel healthier. Um, and uh, things are things are going well. So I'm encouraged. Thanks for watching. This has been Aaron with MySugarFreeJourney.com. Bye-bye.